Well, happy day after Father's Day. I thought we would take a devotion to think about our Heavenly Father this Monday. Um, thinking about God's desire for us. You know, in Genesis chapter 11, verse 6 and 7, the Lord said, If as one people speaking the same language they have begun to do this, then nothing they plan to do will be impossible for them. Come, let us go down and confuse their language so they will not understand each other. Hmm. What is God's desire for us? I mean, what does he want from you and me? Well, God's will is actually, it's really simple. God wants us to be with him for ever, like starting from now until forever and ever. And because of that, God stepped into human history in a big way. Humanity was on the fast track to completely rejecting God and his love. They were all about making a name for themselves. That's what they desired. Often that's what we desire still today, trying to make a name for ourselves. Uh, they were rebelling against God. They were refusing to spread out around the world as God had instructed them. And we too rebel against God every time we sin. We too often refuse to spread his word, to share the good news of Jesus with the people in our lives and the people who cross our path. Well, in Genesis 11, it was actually a, an act of amazing grace where God con confused their languages um, and you might say amazing grace yeah definitely i mean note the name that he used to speak of himself god he said it's the lord right and when he uses the word lord we are reminded that our god is faithful and he is faithful to his justice but he's also faithful to his love and so in amazing grace, the Lord confused their languages. Now, again, you may say, why? <laughs> That's because ultimately that would result in the circumstances for the most people possible to turn their attention to him, to believe in the Lord and to end up in heaven. Remember, that's his ultimate goal. That's his greatest desire. And it's still his greatest desire for me and for you. He desires that as many of us as possible end up in heaven. And thank God that he is willing to do whatever it takes to get us there. <laughs> Let's pray. Oh, Savior, work in our lives in whatever way is necessary so that through your word and sacraments, we stay on the path to heaven and that we will share this good news, this gospel, again, in word and sacrament uh, with all those uh, we come in contact with, all those you bring into our lives uh, to be an influence, uh, to share this good news, to share your love, to share Jesus. And in his name we pray. Amen. All right. Have a great week in the Lord. Thanks for joining me.